Yo peeps, what's going on? Right, really interesting day today. We are hopefully gonna get some access that I've never had before. It's kind of a bit of an experiment. We're gonna meet uh, Waco Canis, who plays for UFL League leaders, uh, Loyola Miraclo Barks. They're taking on bottom of the table Hasselgad today. And Waco said come around to his house and uh, have some breakfast. <laughs> How do you like it? So what's it like playing football in the Philippines? Well, when I was back in Spain, I was playing third division. Here the contract is better. What I don't really like, as you probably saw, is fun. The ambience is not really different culture and stuff. So that's why I ended up here. And then I like it because, I don't know, the people, I think it's a good place to stay. So Waka is going to go to the gym. Yep. I've obviously done my workout already this morning. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm already done, That's so I'll go for a coffee. But Simon, your manager, yeah. said that I could have access to the changing room. Do you want to let me know what I can do and what I can't do? Um, pretty much as much as, uh, as much as little as you want, you know. I don't, I don't have too many issues about you uh, being in and around the boys. Obviously, they've still got a job to do, and what we're finding at the minute is that a lot of this is about self-motivation. You know, when you walk in the stadium at the minute, 1:45 in the afternoon, it doesn't, it's not screaming at you, hey, it's going to be a big game today. Right. So trying to get these guys to be as professional as they can be time and time again, making sure that their heads on the fact that we've got to score as many goals as we can against quite possibly weaker opposition. Now I used to work with them at the LSPN. Good nice car. Okay. SD card is full. When we're talking, etc., etc., the, the players' attention's on me. Yeah. Grab them, have a little chat with them, no problem at all. I'm okay. not sure if you're allowed on the bench, I'll just have to check with the match official. So get things right. If we've got to change it and stick to up front, we can change it halfway through a game. That's fine, if we're chasing goals. So we start making sure that we get the shape right. We don't have a huge amount of time on the training ground between now and JP Voltes, and JP Voltes is important. So we use this as much as we go out, three points is number one priority. And as soon as we get one or two up, we start to see people smiling. Nothing's as serious as it is when it was nil-nil. So get the early goals. Work hard for it. Close people down. Nick it. Put it in the back of the net. Get three up and we can start enjoying it. We took global very close. Possibly should have taken something off it. We win all our games up until the end of the round there's a good chance we'll be on top. Make sure we're aware of the cards as well. Anyone who's been suspended already, you're on two.
One go, close one, drop off. Hey, hey, hey! Contact afterwards, hey! Well done, Jimmy. No turn. Good, John. Well done, John. Get out the way, Kurt. Jason, Jimmy's head! Go on, Koichi, off you go, Koichi, come on! Who's making the run in there? Come on! The finish, Kurt! Oh, end the gap! Great finish, Kurt! Come on, we go again, come on! Why has Koichi got two? One of you go, man, one of you drop off! It's a big kick! Oh, unlucky, great ball, Phil! Well done, Jimmy, good running, Koichi, good stuff! Even if you've got to go and stand in between the two centre backs and attack the ball from there, that's fine. Drop that little bit deeper, leave him in there so that when it comes you're just going to go up over him. You can drop as far back as the centre backs, that's yeah. fine. But don't just stand here and let the ball come over your head three times. You've yeah. got to win that. Yeah. Big guy at the back, okay, they've got one guy and they're smashing it as hard as they can. Get him to go and stand on him, put your arms out like that. Put your body on him so he can't move, you win the header. Okay? You're, trying to, you're trying to win the ball off Godzilla, you don't need to. Billy, yeah, no more dry towels. That's it. That's it. That's it. No. I'm, I'm planning for two more goals. But I gave that one to Phil because I want him to have goals a lot. Confidence. Drone was good, man. When you when it's up there, if it's hovering, is there a button that you just click that's just like hover? Stay? No, it hovers anyway. Oh yeah. yeah. So you don't have to. No. So it hovers anyway. Then you just choose left, right, up, down. Yeah. Forward, back. Forward, back. And then you press the button, it'll just come home. Oh no way! Oh, yeah. something connected to you. Oh, the, the device. Well, and there's the GPS. There's the yeah, GPS yeah, yeah. coordinates. That's cool. You're getting on second half. Are you okay? I'm injured. I had a small MCL strain, so just resting today. How'd you get that? Just in training on Monday, so I was suspended last game, so it doesn't help. I've had two two games missed now. Start the forward line by backwards. It's been good, it's taken a little bit of getting used to because there's less options now when we look up and go forward. So we're having to be very careful with those passes because now we only have one, possibly a late joining option. So every time we look up and we see Phil, we're having to be very careful to keep it to his feet because it's fairly obvious it's going to Phil. Because if you're there, you can step onto the ball, go over him and bang it away. If you're just, you're never going to catch up. So he's given an angle so we can get it, that's fine. It's going to be on this side so we can receive it if we're going to play it into it. If you're going to put it a yard that way, a yard that way, they know it's coming, they're going to take it off it. It's not like when we had Alvaro next to it, where they're in the middle and thinking, well, look, I'm going to go there, I'm going to go there, shit, they've got it, I move there, it goes to the field, field, puts it back in there. There's less options now, so we have to be careful. Those balls into feet have got to be good. They've got to be on the right side so we can turn them. Play a little one, two with field. If that little gap opens up, drives through, get shot off. Whenever you've moved the ball quickly, they've not been able to deal with it. If we can see, I will be pissed. There's no way we should be giving chances like that to an opposition like this. Okay? Let's get back out there. Tell you what, seeing a professional coach giving his half-time team talk is something different. It's not quite a Des Corkill, is it? This dude here has got the best t-shirt on. Greg, have a picture of your... Yeah, I love it, man. <laughs> Thank you. Cheat, coy cheat. Go on, coy cheat. Well done. And relax. Nice and easy. And don't stop walking. Get up. Oh. <laughs> Good. Well done, Anton. Well done. Yes. Well done. Great ball in. Well done. Well done. Come on, John. Get the range right. Come on. How many goals this season? Don't want to be big headed, but <laughs> I've lost count of it. I don't keep track. Oh, no. <laughs> Top scorer or not? Top scorer, yeah. Eddie, just open out. That guy over there is a problem. Seconds, who's going to come and get it? Jason's feet. Cut! Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Good stuff. Keep getting it shifted. Good. Keep it moving. That's right, Jason. Squeeze it in. Come on, squeeze it in. John, anything going in there, you win it. Cordy, just drop a couple onto toast. I hooked you up, man. Put on a silver platter for you. What can I do? So obviously one of the purposes of this vlog is to try and bring you a bit closer to, you know, some real sports action. And hopefully we've kind of done that today. I mean, we've got some amazing access, right? Yeah, hey, thanks for looking after me today. You made me breakfast this morning. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sweet for me, yeah? It's really sweet. Very hey, so do you have a, like a little bet at the start of the season with your brother? No, no, no. Um, 
Actually, the start of the season, my brother, we had a week before we was going to start our first game and my brother actually got injured. All right. So then I had to step into his position. And so, not saying I'll try to steal it off him, but I've enjoyed playing there. Happy with that, coach? <laughs> yes, 9-0 is good enough. Yeah. <laughs> nine is good enough. You beat who's in front of you, but the games will get tougher. It's, good, div right? it's difficult not to be, uh, you know, you find yourself talking in cliches a lot. So you try and work against that. But at the same time, didn't need to change too much. Just make sure they remember, bigger picture. We keep going and get the goals. Hey, thanks for today. Appreciate uh, no it. Problem. Yeah, no problem. Awesome, bro. No problem. I'll, uh, Let me know when things are put together and I can have a look.